Hey guys and welcome back to another Unreal Engine Marketplace video. Today is a new type of video which I'm doing and that's going to be covering some of the best free assets released on the Unreal Engine Marketplace during February 2023. So today I have four different assets which are completely free and were released last month, so February of this year. So again, this is a new content idea for me, so let me know in the comments down below if this is something you'd like to see more of going forwards. But without further ado, let's just get right into it, starting with Interactive World. So Interactive World is a plugin which allows you to create interactive snow, mud, water and foliage areas in a large world. So you can see on screen now a playable demo which they have created for you to use and you can really see how it all works. So in the mud you're going to be leaving muddy footprints and you can roll around something as well to leave marks of that too. The foliage will just kind of move as you're walking through it so they'll kind of get out of the way slightly. The water will leave a trail behind you as you're wading through it and the snow is going to leave a nice big trail as you go through as well. And again all of these will work for pushing something through as well, it's not just the player walking. So some technical details of this are a world drawing board, so you have snow trails, water wave simulation, foliage interact and footsteps on mud, as well as being able to designate areas with physics volume, large world support and also auto activate and shut off simulation if no brush is drawn on, so basically it's also going to be running nice and efficiently. In total there are 12 blueprints and 5 C++ classes to make it again nice and efficient, but also this is not network replicated. So as you can see on screen now, I think this one looks absolutely amazing. It runs efficiently, gives a great effect, and is all around just great. This has 55 star reviews. Now I'm not sure how legit those are because this only came out February 11th and I'm recording this March 1st and it's got 55 star reviews already. But maybe this is just someone big that I don't know and that's why they've managed to get a lot. But this is absolutely amazing like I say. Next up it is the fixed camera system. Now this is another plugin which allows you to add cinematic cameras by easily dragging them into the scene and you can use different tools to configure their style and path. So the features of this are you can easily add the various actors and tools by dragging them into the scene. There is a custom tab has been added to the editor to facilitate the placement of actors. There is an example scene included which you can see on screen now and it's also going to be open for future updates. So there are 5 blueprints and 4 C++ classes. And again, this isn't network replicated, however you wouldn't need that for this. So essentially, you're going to be able to walk to different areas of the map, different rooms in the building, or anything along those lines. So you just go to different areas, and the camera will then change to be in a static position, looking into the area you've walked into. Now it's not completely static, it does have a bit of movement to it as well, so it just looks a lot nicer. But it gives this really nice effect, if that's the style of game you're going for. The only thing I will mention is that the controls of the player have a sudden change, as the camera angle changes because obviously forward isn't the same direction when the camera has changed so you might want to modify this slightly to maybe have a smoother transition or keep the controls always the same so W always goes the same direction regardless of whether that looks forward or not to the player's camera perspective or also you could just make sure you position these in such places that the transition will not be janky because you'd expect it to change but that's just one thing that I've noticed with it. This has one review and it is also a 5 star review. So they say this asset works very well, it's very intuitive and easy to use, especially for those who know less about cameras and blueprints, highly recommended and I do have to commend that as well, it does look and feel absolutely great. Next up is the Control Rig Samples Pack. Now this one is actually by Epic Games, it's part of the Epic content, which is slightly surprising because although this is absolutely great, there are still quite a few features with it that aren't amazing. For example the animations don't loop and for the character animation as well you can notice the pinky finger is always stuck in one place it's not moving. Now obviously that's not too bad because they are just sample animations that you don't have to use you can make your own and just use the control rig itself and that's kind of what it's for it's for you to use the control rig not the animations they've made however you'd expect their examples to be of a slightly higher quality but again that is just something small you're not getting it for the animations, you're getting it for the control rig and the epic content as well is more just to help you learn the basics of this stuff. So this will help you learn control rigs very easily. So as I've said on here, this asset pack contains sample control rigs for creating animations directly inside Unreal Engine. The rigs included are pre-built and ready to be animated or pulled apart for learning purposes. So you have a cardboard box, you have a UE5 mech, you have a bungee man and you have mannequin bipeds. 
So again, the models of these look absolutely fantastic. The animations as well are great. Obviously, just a little bit of a few things here and there which could be changed, which I've just mentioned. But other than that, it looks absolutely amazing. And finally, last but not least, we have the Megascans Trees European Beach Early Access. So this collection is an early access tree pack with 17 unique models of varying maturity to build a photorealistic beach forest. The pack includes powerful foliage mass materials to control seasons and wind. So as this is early access, there's not a lot in here at the moment, but if you just wanted some basic trees, this works perfectly. So the total number of unique meshes is 17, and there's 88 materials and material instances. The number of material instances per tree is 2 to 5, and the number of textures is 30 trees, 36 imposters, and 34 pivot painters. The texture resolutions for these range from 2K all the way up to 8K. And there are LODs as well. There are 8 for the saplings and 9 for the trees. And all of these 17 meshes do have collision and light map UVs. So these look absolutely great. The screenshots on the marketplace page show it off better than the map they have provided. But this again looks fantastic if you wanted European beach trees inside of your game or projects. So I think that'll be it for this video covering the best free assets released on the Unreal Engine Marketplace in February 2023. Obviously a bit of a shorter video today as there wasn't a lot on there, but again let me know in the comments down below if you like this kind of video. I think my favourite one this time around was probably the fixed camera system or the interactive world and let me know in the comments down below which one your favourite one as well. So thanks so much for watching this video, I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you found it helpful. And if you did, please do make sure to like and subscribe down below. So thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.